we have yet to get any of that from Capcom. So here's to hoping, here's to hoping that, you know, by the time I upload this, you know, let's say maybe within a week, maybe within a day, Capcom releases another trailer and, you know, keeps us coming back, you know, keeps us, you know, that carrot on the stick <laughs> leading us to um, hype for the actual release of the game. We still have quite a few months to go, at least. Oh, is this it? Welcome, travelers. I present okay, you there you go. <laughs> Azus, the ever uh, you know, one thing, okay? The everyone else within the you know that's reacted to the trailer have made comments about oh the monster designs are great. I don't think the designs of this this you know this whole village right the outfits their whole culture has been given enough credit right. It is very very unique okay very distinct. It does remind me kind of a bit like how do I how do I say this the. The whole atmosphere, the whole scenario feels kind of like, you know, Shadow of the Colossus, okay? <laughs> right? But yeah, yeah, everyone's outfits, you know, the culture, it is very, very unique, let's say, right? And it's very, very well done. And yeah, also I appreciate, right, the amount of color that they use, which is in very, very weird contrast to the environment, which I will get to in They're a bit. Starting without us. Just look at that firebrand go. Yeah, so here's the thing. The whole environment, uh, so called the oil whale, oil, oil whale, oil well, <laughs> god damn it, English, oil well basin, okay? Now I get that it's supposed to be this, you know, entire place that's covered in sludge, covered in oil. I don't like that it's all black and monotone like this, any other given opportunity, okay? Because oil, and here's, you know, here's any excuse I would give the developers to put some goddamn color into anything they make, <clears throat> excuse me, because modern developers these days, you know, have a bad habit of making everything sort of washed out, okay, they sort of put a filter on everything, you know, they wash out the colors just for, to, f I, I don't know what it is, maybe they're trying to make it realistic, I... I don't like it, okay? But oil, okay? Oil has this property that makes it sort of reflective that you, you kind of notice, you know, when you see oil, uh, an oil spilled on the side of the road or something, it has that kind of rainbowy thing that's missing from this place, okay? It's missing that uh, very signature. Yeah, yeah, look at this, look at this. There's nothing here. Come on now. <laughs> it's missing that signature rainbow reflection y type sheen found in oil and i wish they included that because that's a good excuse to not make the whole thing just one single color everything is just black and gray i hate it i hate it right but don't get me wrong don't get me wrong the entire concept of the place oil well oil oil well i keep saying oil but god damn it okay oil well basin it's it's very interesting, okay? <laughs> it's a whole place that's covered in flammable oil, okay? You you know what you can do with that. You, you expect... We know we already know what to expect knowing that, okay? What's going to happen to this place. But yeah, it is an interesting, interesting loca location, locale, environment. But I wish they actually did something with the oil. But yeah, here we go. First monster reveal. Okay, so... <laughs> okay, number one, number one. The first thing that came to my mind, okay? The reveal. <laughs> Is that... <laughs> it looks like a ball sack. <laughs> Freaking Gary old man Dracula looking ass. Okay. okay, okay. But yeah, in all seriousness. It's not bad, it's not bad. It's very, very original. So, again... I got my I got my wish from you know, the last video that I mentioned. That's a very very original monster design. Like holy shit, holy shit! How do how do they think of this? They, they probably got in contact with freaking the FromSoft monster designers or something. Okay, this this looks straight out of something like you know tailored, but you know they painted it black. I it's pretty it's pretty sweet. It's pretty sweet. Interesting. 
Ah, look at that. You have a bunch of like gas bubbles, okay, and that explode from under the ground. That's ah, that's interesting. I don't know if anyone else has um, pointed that out. But anyway, like um, interesting way to um, add environmental you know hazards within the location. And now here we go, second monster. God, like I'm, I'm getting I'm getting PTSD flashbacks from fighting Rajan. But basically, this guy is just you know fire monkey. Okay, just <laughs> uh, the design is very much like you know if Odo Garen um, um, had a uh, had a little bit of a romantic you know getaway with uh, Rajan. But uh, yeah, you can do a clash against him. That's interesting. They don't show nearly enough of that guy. Um, I feel like they could have stand to um, put him a bit, given him a bit more screen time in this trailer, but oh well, oh well. There's not much to say. We only know what it looks like and that it sets itself on fire and that's about it. <sighs> anyway. We beckon the fire spray so, yeah. with our own hands. Like, look at this, okay? Everyone has their own like outfits, they have their own accessories. This is very nice, nice touches. And they've got even like gold thingies that they put on their clothes. Which makes sense because you know they, they have a village here that's built around a forge. So that's that's cool little detail that the um, designers placed in there. That everyone has their cultural trinkets, already right? their accessories and metal and gold stuff that reflects, you know. That they have a forge. <laughs> and yeah, the entire place. As you would expect, okay. Lights up like like anything. It's it's the whole place is covered in oil. And yo, I love this. I love this. Now it's it's interesting that you triggered the whole thing from all the way there. Like how? Okay, okay, so... Okay, there it is. You trigger that thing. You either shoot it with um, a gun or, you know, a clutch claw or a pod or something. And it triggers this. Bam! <laughs> Just like a Dragonator except blunt force trauma. There we go, that guy got CTE'd. Okay, anyway. Moving on. That's an interesting looking... Like, is this, is this a, is this a lance? That's a lance, isn't it? That's <laughs> giant syringe. Oh, that's, oh, that's a really, oh, that's a very, very fun design for a lance, actually. Oh, damn. Sick move, though. That's a, yeah, that's very nice. That's very nice. <laughs> Also, by the way, Capcom, Capcom cooked with this design. <laughs> it's gotta be said. Okay, you know me. I'm a man of culture. Okay, Capcom was absolutely cooking, and I don't know why they made the other girl, the handler, look like Mia Khalifa, but they did. Okay, I'm not going to question their decisions. I'm just going to say that you know, I don't object. No, we never wanted this to happen. No stopping it now. Not once it starts flowing. Yeah, here we go. New monster coming up. This is a completely original one, okay? I'm seeing people say that it looks like a famous monster that existed, but no, apparently this is entirely original. And they made him an octopus. It's... Hey. Yeah, it's an... <laughs> there's a funny little play on the whole octopus concept that instead of, you know, an op you know, how squids, okay? So maybe some octopuses also... Uh, fire ink out of their ink sacs to deter prey, but you know, since the whole place is covered in oil, they decided to make uh, an octopus that is pretty much made out of ink, or in this case, oil, I suppose you should say. So yeah, and he blows out, you know, breeds fire. I don't know how he doesn't set himself on fire, but we're not going to question it too much, okay? So yeah, this is a, this is a freaking... Mortal Kombat freaking fatality right here. <laughs> he just grabs onto him, okay? You see you see the hunter desperately trying to get out and then just flames over him in the face. 
Ooh, boy, that's a that's a dead hunter. That is a crispy hunter right there. That is an axe hunter. <laughs> oh, that's great. So there it is. Uh, very quick one for today, ladies and gentlemen. But yeah, we managed to predict, you know, the trailer that's coming up. No Elder Dragons revealed just yet, okay? Apparently... Apparently, Mr. Octopus is uh, an apex predator, but you know, no confirmation of whether he is not a Elder Dragon or such. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So there it is, ladies and gentlemen. That's uh, that's the trailer, okay? Very short one for today. I don't have a whole lot of time. Um, we got hit recently by a hurricane, so uh, we got a lot of fixing to do around the house. So I'll leave it short, but you know, after this, enjoy the rest of the gameplay footage. I will leave you with that. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time, okay? Now don't get the hell out just yet. <laughs> Watch the rest of the game. Thank you, and goodbye. Oh, and like and subscribe, and all that. I appreciate you. Goodbye.